Hello, we are so glad to see you. Hi guys, welcome to this quick tutorial video about what term five is gonna look like. Today you're gonna hear from a, diff a couple different teachers and coaches about how to make sure that you are ready to go for term five. All of our classes are going to be online. So even if you're supposed to be in algebra one or US history, all of those classes are gonna be taught online. And so this video is to help you to figure out what you need to do to be prepared uh, to start classes on Monday, April 6th. If you haven't filled out the contact form about updating us about technology and your um, phone number, please make sure that you reach out to your coach so that we can make sure that everyone has the capability to be able to be online with us in term five. And now without further ado, top five things you need to know to get ready for term five. Number one, you need to know your email. Hi students, we are meeting you uh, through Zoom and I'm gonna share with you how to uh, get to your email. So you need, you should all have an Excel email. The, that is the email in which your uh, teachers uh, will be communicating uh, with you on is your Excel email, not your personal email. So you're gonna wanna make sure you have your Excel email ready. Um, you should be hopefully seeing my screen. Are my teachers seeing my screen? Awesome. Okay, when you go to your email, make sure that when you sign in, you're going to go to uh, Gmail. And hopefully a lot of you had practiced with this already. But, okay, so you should get into your sign-in page that looks something like this. When you go in, make sure that you put your first name dot last name, and then you'll have your three numbers that come from um, your student ID numbers, which you would have gotten uh, through your coach. So if you don't know those, you'll need to contact your coach to get that information. And then it'll be at excelcenter.org. That's what you'll type in. I'm gonna go ahead and um, just repeat that real quick. It's your first name, dot last name, three numbers at excelcenter.org. I'm gonna go ahead and put mine in as an example real quick. And remember, we're only going to be communicating with you through your Excel email. So we're not going to be able to communicate with, your, with other emails um, throughout uh, your e-learning time. So once you get your email in, hit next. It should accept it. You should see your email up here right now. And your password is going to be uh, your month in numbers. So let's say that you were born in May. So let me show you how that would look. If you were born in, like if your birthday was May 23rd, 1985, that's how you would type it in. Dot first initial, so mine would be like, Sarah and, and second last initial Badgley and then you would hit next and that should bring you into your email address. Hey guys, remember if you've changed that password, contact Mr. James and he can help you get that uh, set up anew. Now on to number two, Zoom meetings like we're doing now. Hello! Hi friends! I hope you've all been amazing. So we're going to be meeting with all of you guys through Zoom. And you could do that on your phone or on your computer. So I'm going to show you how to do it on the browser. So share the screen. All right. Can you all see what I'm doing right here? Mm -hmm. So you just go and you put zoom.us. And this is going to come up over here. And then you'll click sign up. It's free on the top right corner. The beautiful thing is we can use our Excel Center emails. So I would put my first name, my last name, and the three digits from your ID at excelcenter.org. And then you'll click sign up. At the moment, it's not going to show you that because it's going to send you an email. You'll go to your email and you'll, you'll click the confirmation link. Then you can create a password 
and then you'll start receiving email invites from your teachers to join the meetings. And let me tell you the really cool part. Open the App Store, download Zoom. You could do it, no excuse, regardless of where you are. Enjoy Zooming. <laughs> Next up, number three, Google Classroom. Oh, he's muted. <laughs> there we go, Mr. Eric. All right, question. How do I get into my Google Classroom? Once you are enrolled in a class, you'll receive an invitation to your Google Classroom that should look like this. Hmm. Once you get your invitation, you're going to click on Join. And that will take you to your Google Classroom. If you ever need to get back into your Google Classroom, all you need to do is log on to your Excel Center Gmail account, go to your Google Apps bar, click there, scroll down, click on Classroom, and then all your classrooms will appear. And all you need to do is click on the classroom you want to get into, and you are entered into a world of learning. Number four on your top things to know, Odysseyware. Hey guys, Miss Elise here. Odysseyware is the place where almost 95% of our learning is going to happen, so you need to know how to get onto your Odysseyware. So here is how we are going to do it. Can everybody see me okay or see our directions all right? Awesome. So at the top you have the website. It is goodwill.owschools.com. From there, you're going to have to sign in to your account. Everybody has an account. Your username should look really familiar. It's your first name, dot, last name and the three digits of your STN. If you haven't been able to tell by now, those three digits are important. So if you don't know those three numbers, you need to check with your coach. And make Again, sure that your first initial and your last initial are capitalized. That is not on here. Thank you, Miss Miriam. Your first name, dot, last name, three digits of your STN, and your password is Excel with a capital E, one, two, three. So if I go into Odysseyware, here I am. Uh, I'm going to put my first name, period, last name, and one, two, three. My first, uh, my password is Excel123, and I click Ready, Set, Learn. From there, to start your classes, you're gonna click Learn. This is where you're gonna be going every single day to uh, complete your courses. Your teachers will be grading your work. Your teachers will be connecting with you on Odysseyware. If you have any questions, reach out to your teacher or your coach and they should be able to help you. Thanks, Miss Elise. Number five, it's time for student view. Take it away, Miss Megan. Hi students, so good to see you guys. So I'm just gonna tell you a little bit about Student View. Um, Student View is a super important app. It's something you can just have on your phone, but it's a great way to catch up on your grades, um, see how you're progressing in your classes, and it will let you know what your schedule is for term five. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen here. Can everybody see this? All right, so um, first um, on your phone, your smartphone, you're gonna look up Student View. It should look like this, it's a little green app. Um, and then it's gonna ask you to enter your zip code. You're gonna enter 4622 and choose Goodwill Education Initiatives. It should be the first one that comes up. And then when it asks you, I'm gonna move this over here. When it asks you um, if you accept the, let me move this over here. If you have an activation key, you're gonna say, say yes. And for that activation key, you do need to get in touch with your life coach. They can look it up for you really quick. Um, it should just be a special password that's specific to you. So just reach out to your life coach and they can get it for you. And then in the bottom right corner, you're gonna say, yes, I accept the terms and conditions. 
um, you will enter your first name and your last name in that special activation code. And then you can create a specialized um, username and password for yourself. And then it should take you into um, a screen that gives you, again, like I said, your grades. Um, you should be able to see your schedule and all sorts of things that pertain to your education here with us. So if you have any questions, you can feel free to reach out to your life coach at any time. All right, guys, you've learned a lot of information. Top five things you need to know to get ready for term five. Please remember to reach out to your coach and your teachers and to get your Excel Center email address going. Uh, we will do our very best to be in contact with you every day. Thanks for hanging tight with us. Uh, we wish you the best. Please make sure you wash your hands. You stay six feet away from each other. And if you need a mask, a diaper, preferably clean, works just fine. So if or you mask. Or Miss Anwar's sleep mask works just fine. <laughs> All right, folks, have a good day. We will see you soon um, for term five. Bye. Bye-bye.